Fox 54 Sports, sponsored by Alpha Insurance. Hey everybody, now the sweetest bowl game of them all is happening in a mere three days when Alabama goes head-to-head -head with Big 12 champion Kansas State in the Sugar Bowl. The Tide are still a touchdown favorite in this contest, but this game could be closer than many expect it to be. See, this year, Kansas State's defense has been surprisingly good. The Kansas State defense, well, it's ranked first in the Big 12 in points allowed with 20 per game, third in yards allowed, and second in sacks with 28. K-State defense coordinator, um, he's, he's laid out the blueprint on how his unit can find success against its Alabama offense. We're just trying to, trying to win each series, win each play, and, and I think when you stack enough of those together, um, that's that's the that's the magic, and uh, you know, just trying to find ways to continue to, to give different pictures and different looks on each snap, so that we can we can um, have success on that snap. And then when you put it together, 60 minutes of that, you end up with a good result. All right, on the other side of the ball is a talented Alabama offense. Tide fans could see Bryce Young in an Alabama jersey for the final time this weekend inside the Caesar Superdome. Young and the Tide, they're putting up about 475 yards per game. And since losing to LSU, Alabama is averaging about 454 yards per contest to close out the season. Tide offensive coordinator Bill O'Brien has been the wizard behind this offense, but he admits that Kansas State's defense could be a unit that presents a challenge to move the ball up and down the field consistently. Kansas State is a team that uh, is really disciplined. Uh, they play a unique style of defense. They play hard. They play tough. They've got good speed at all uh, at the second and third levels. They play very tough up front, good pass rushers, good guys against the run. They do a great job of taking the ball away. Um, you, you know, so we, we have a big challenge ahead of us. Our, our two weeks of practice, you know, in Tuscaloosa and now in New Orleans have, have been very, very good, very productive. The guys have been great. They've been working really hard. All right, Saturday Sugar Bowl has an 11 a.m. kickoff. You can watch it live on ESPN.